greatest alive. I'm the greatest alive. I'm the greatest. If fear me, ain't nobody seeing me. All right, got another video for you guys. Um, if, you, if you've been accepted into TCNJ, congratulations. Welcome to the school. Great people here. Great, great, great students and staff. Great, great place to receive your higher education. But uh, I want to talk about things to know as an incoming freshman. You know, being being accepted to an institution like this is, is nice. So it's welcoming. It's nice to nice to receive it. But uh, it's gonna work, man. The, 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 you don't receive your education here. You know, the, it's, it's high standards here. Um, they set high goals for students to receive an education, to take the degrees, and go further beyond. So, whatever major you decide to be, whether it be political science, which I, which I am as a junior, political science major, whether it be like a STEM major, like engineering, or be going to be a mathematician one day, or or you know, study a science, like just just know that you're gonna work either way, you know. TCNJ is known for it was known for its education. It was originally a teaching school, hundreds of years ago. It was originally a teaching school, but now it's still recognized as a higher uh, education school. STEM majors, especially engineers, highly rated here. We also have a pretty decent business school. I used my freshman year. I was a <laughs> I was a accounting major. Then I'm like, man, ain't the life for me. But now I'm a political science major. Glad I switched over. So if you ever decide switch majors, it's always an easy, smooth process. Just you know, figure out what you want to do. As a freshman, if, you, if you're coming here, I would recommend bringing a lot of fans. No matter whether you're being, I'm looking at the towers right now, whether you live in the 10-story towers or you live in some other freshman dorm, it just brings up fans because there's no air conditioning and it gets very hot in August, September, a little bit of October, and definitely in the last few weeks in May. It was, uh, it was the second semester, so please, whatever you do, bring the fans. And I recommend bringing at least three or four, because I'm running brought one. I'm like, thought that was enough. You don't understand how hot it is in there. Oh my God, it gets so hot in there. So please bring a lot of fans if you got it. Please save yourself before, like we didn't save ourselves. One thing that uh, TCNJ is not really known for its campus life. We do have athletics, which I'll talk about in a little bit. We do have Greek life, but it's like, it's not like a big university like Rutgers that's 45 minutes an hour away. You know, it's not like a Penn State. You know, it's not a big giant university where there's a lot of people and a lot of things to do. But what's great about TCNJ is like smack dab in the middle between Philadelphia and uh, in New York City, so you go either one. You know, if you're from like North Jersey, of course you don't go to New York City. If you're from South Jersey, of course you like, you know what Philly is like. So it's like, find whichever place you can go to to separate yourself from TCNJ. Cause it's not a lot of things to do, TCNJ itself. But if you can, you can always travel somewhere else. You can always catch a bus somewhere. You can always catch a train to go somewhere else. And uh, you know, find things to do. But on campus, uh, it's, it's very campus events, but uh, it ain't for me. I don't know. Might be for you. I don't know who you are and how you might go about things. But tend tend to be the events here. Tend tend to be fun. But if you find good people, you can, you can make it fun. You know, you can make it fun here. Uh, parties and stuff. As I say, TCNJ is a, a drinking school. Maybe a little. <laughs> nah, I, I ain't gonna say that. It is definitely a drinking school. So if you love a good, a good drink, you can find a lot of places to do that and then enjoy yourself and have a good time. Like I mentioned earlier, we do have athletics. Um, currently myself, I'm on the football team, junior. About to be my final ride, my fourth year coming up. Um, so we do, do have athletics as a D3 school. So you're not gonna get any scholarships. You know, you know, D3, they don't get scholarships. You know, it's mostly D2 and D1, of course. So you can't get athletic scholarships here, but you can get recruited. They can reserve a spot for you. So if you're an athlete and you excel in high school, maybe get in touch with uh, the coaches here. They always accept it. They always, especially the football team. If you're a football player, please. If you got good grades, please. <laughs> Check us out, and we we're trying to be on the come up, you know. New coaching staff for the last couple of years. We we're trying to be on the come up. We're on the grind. We're trying to win some championships. Please come here. Um, athletics. We are 
excellent field hockey team. Always win championships. Always go to uh, the championships uh, games. Um, lacrosse is the same. Women's soccer is the same. Recent years, men's soccer and uh, baseball has been doing doing well. So, uh, you know, we D three school and we, we smart as hell. Still in there, I'd be athlete, so there's always that that balance. So finding that balance is difficult because it's such a high rigorous education institution. But find that balance between it, athletics and uh, and uh, and an education, you can find it. I made a previous video <laughs> about the thing I don't like this in J. Food here specifically is not the best the main dining hall called icoff hall where you can just swipe in it's like buffet style get whatever you want it's very hit or miss you know i tend to get the same thing as every i get tend to get the same thing as always consistent because it's always consistently good or decent rather but we do have other forms of uh, other locations for seafood um our student center, also known as the Den, has a variety of foods. Those are pretty good, but those cost points. And if you don't got a lot of points, you gotta spend wisely. But we do have Milliquid, where you get like automatically eight dollars is free, so that it helps a lot. It's between the hours of eleven o'clock and one thirty, so if you don't have class between that time, I recommend getting some some Lions Den food there. Um, we have Traditions, which is like a dinner style you know you go in there and get seated and get a server and they actually you what you want to the menu so that's a good service that's always solid decent food the food here is hit or miss you gotta find it <laughs> you gotta find what you like and find what you go and consistently go that's what i recommend is consistently finding what you like you know that's about it maybe uh i'll make a part two i'll figure out any more things those are the things that really stand out for me you uh, know once again if you if you've been stuck with the TCNJ, congratulations. I welcome you to this great school and uh, hopefully you can stay here and prosper. If you like the video, please like the video. I got more content always coming soon, so please subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.